Hello friends, my name is Agi. Today I've prepared a very quick video with sugar effect on Easter egg. Last part of my video is composed of several pictures as I forgot to turn my camera on when applying microbeads. I hope you can forgive me. Before you start, you need to smooth your styrofoam egg with sandpaper grading 240. Then we need to draw line in the middle using pencil. It is important not to press your pencil too hard, as this will damage styrofoam. Now we need to measure 2 cm from middle line towards left and right side, so we end up with 3 parallel lines. At this point we will only need two lines which are on both sides so we must cover the middle one with white primer. Remember to mix your primer well before painting. When everything is dry, we can start choosing our napkin. Paper napkins are made of three layers and we will be using only top colored one. Use small brush and water to tear images out for better blending. Glue pictures on the egg using good quality brush and decoupage glue. Both napkins used in the video are for sale in our shop as well as other decoupage supplies. You can find link to it in the description under the video.
Next step is shading. This time I've decided to use only brown paint as my egg is colorful enough. If you watched my other videos you probably already know how to do the shading around images. But for those of you who didn't get the chance to see it, here is the recipe. Take little bit of brown paint on smaller shading sponge, dip it in the blending medium, then apply it around the images and tap over it with larger sponge to create shading. I will be covering sides with beads, so I only create shading around larger pictures. When everything is properly dry, I would probably leave it for a couple of days to be sure, I apply several coats of triple thick varnish and white relief paste on top in places where I did pencil lines. At the very end I apply solvent-based varnish around my egg between relief paste lines and cover everything with those gorgeous clear micro beads. Because I forgot to turn my camera on I had to make several pictures of another egg for you to see how this is done. I hope you like this sugar effect created with glass micro beads. Thank you for watching and have a lovely Easter!